Hello everyone, this is Imran from WPBank.com. Uh, as you can see, uh, this is our WooCommerce Product Slider plugin called WPB WooCommerce Product Slider. Um, we have uh, this is our free version. Uh, you can download it from WordPress plugin repository. And we have a pro version uh, for this plugin. And pro version gives you some extra features. And you can see check here some extra features. Uh, currently, this plugin version is 2.3. And uh, uh, today I'm gonna show you some new features that come with version 2.0.4. Uh, so let's see what's new feature on the new version of this plugin so i'm gonna create a new page and you may notice there is a button called product slider all you have to do is click on this button and uh, pop up here um, and you need to configure the product slider as you'll need uh, here is a product slider title that will show on the top of the product slider so um the title here is a for some product type you can select uh, like uh, by default it's come with the latest products of WooCommerce and you can select featured products, category products, product by product ID, product by product SQ, SQ. So I'm gonna select latest product and number of products you, that by default it will call 10 products from your e-commerce product and number of columns and default is four column. They have, we have two different themes for this plugin and there you can choose a theme by default is hover theme, uh, slider autoplay, default yes, product order by product order and and there is another tab called advanced setting here you can configure the advanced settings of this slider plugin you can change your product image width image height you can choose the hard crop if you want your product image too big then you can choose this option for cropping the image you can you can enable disable the slider pagination and navigation from here and one more interesting thing that is our advanced column setting for this plugin if you need this this feature to change then you can click on this checkbox here it will come the <coughs> sorry, advanced column setting, then you can change the number of column on medium display, medium desktop display, small desktop display, tablet screen or mobile screen. So after changing the options, all you have to do is just click on this button called insert shortcut. It will uh, it will paste a shortcut on your editor and I'm gonna publish this new page. Uh, if we view this page on the browser, you can see a new product slider plugin here and for I'm gonna show another theme try now. Box theme. Here you can see the another theme for this plugin. So thank you very much for watching this video.